No, you didn't burn your toast. That's the smell of Nuked London still smoking in the background. We are at Fumbly Stadium, of course, home of the Nuked London Patriots. This town has a lot of history. You got some of the founding fathers of pro wrestling here. Yeah, Slam Adams for one. And he had a wicked neck crunching pile driver move. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team stormed the field. The full middle may have bang heads against the New London Patriots. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I'm totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. Kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. Oh man, what a throw! Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. Oh man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should. And it's first and ten. And he punches it. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You got to punt it here. Come on. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their feet boost injection. Close your eyes, Briggs. This is going to get ugly fun. First down and one. Talking to yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? Can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open.
And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. And the defense calls a thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's got to hurt. Don't make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. Man, this guy could teach you a thing or two, Chris. He's an orc, Bricks. He probably only knows a thing or two. Hey, you want me to tell him what you just said? Yeah, no need for that. Let the man dance. <laughs> Nice time warp dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait a minute. What the? Ah, did they? Didn't they just? I hope you You know, you got to put the buzz on the MVP conversation, Briggs. Got more kills than anyone in the league right now. Yeah, you make a good point. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. He's not going down, and that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, and, oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. He could go all the way. He's at the 30. He might catch him. Oh, you fat loud mutant. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? First down and five. There aren't too many players that can... Oh, and he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble! He's got a case of fumbleitis. And that'll bring up second and one. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just be caught. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance on. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches?
Please? Eh, did it taste so good? I'm pretty sure my baby sister can throw further than that. But she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And that'll be second down. Ships the ball. Thank you very much, Chef at the Fit. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. Holy Montezuma's revenge! That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. No, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they got out the gas. What the fuck are you talking about? Now, what day is it? Second down and seven. see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon rabi blood is my thought what was a player's favorite <laughs> first and two And that'll be second down and four. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. It should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kick. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. They're and it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 40, and the defense is on his heels. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. into the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Finally. And it's first and ten. Oh. 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 
shuffled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Hit. And the crowd loves it. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. to go. Too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. Third down and forever. Hey guys, this isn't funny. I swear to drunk, I'm not God, but seriously, stay in drugs, eat school, and don't three yard catch on the play. Every little bit counts. Those three yards. Somebody one day. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. Certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. First and ten. Football is a team sport, and that's 
That's why you should never think about mine unless it's that kind. Oh, that was nasty. Oh, nice hit. is running low on running backs. They have only two left. You need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. That ball was almost intercepted. Third down and, well, good luck. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Brix. Very smart. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. And it's first and ten. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And that'll be second down and four. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Third and four. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot. One. Hot. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about shit. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he landed. Man, what a hit that was. Second down and nine.
And it's first and ten. Well, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soylent beer? And they're taking the field for the second half, and we have got a tie score. Uh, speaking of tie, Grim, me and Hot Wanda, we wanted to try something different, so we tied each other up the other night. See, nothing happened because we were both tied up. I don't understand what the big deal is. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. They pick up three on a short pass. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. Second down and seven. And that's another turnover for the defense. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Jack is leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down, Lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. meets the explodable object. No touchdown today. Looks like that defender ate his bleedies this morning. That previous play never happened because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. Now oh, the old Brokeback Mountain play. Got hit by a mountain of Newton. Got the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wynn, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, I don't think the funeral expenses, that is. secondary for you pay him for the pick six for this you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck second down and he smashes that one out of the air for a first down see if they can get something going here first down and one
Second and three. They weren't even on the same page on that play. Third down and three. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Two linemen. Once they're gone, it's game over. Yeah, who cares? Linemen suck. They don't even deliver any fantasy points. They, they spend two years in the league and then they become bouncers at biker bars. And it's first and ten. Second down and a very lot. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. Wow. Third down and the offense needs a miracle. comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? No, oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Shave a foul, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I'm gonna take a beast boost injection too. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The third. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, sit work on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. First down and inch it. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Ghost. 
and nuke London Hatred to obliterate their opponent today and win the game by forfeit. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? I think the mission I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, we can a lot of lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. <laughs> Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stands are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.